Hello and welcome to a new EasyDigitals.com video tutorial. Remember, you can get all of our high quality Photoshop and Photoshop Elements templates at EasyDigitals.com. Just click on the Products button. And don't forget to sign up for our monthly newsletter. We give away free templates and tutorials each and every month, along with product update info and coupons. Okay, Kim, what easy tutorial are you going to show us today? Today I want to go over some of the modifications you can make to the Quick Poster Volume 1. I had a user, an Elements user, email me and ask me several questions and I thought it would be easier if I just did a quick tutorial than to try to explain it all in an email. Her first question is how do I get this frame to be a different color? So I'm going to click on the Move tool, click on the frame, make sure that that layer is selected. Up here under Window you can view the layers palette by clicking on layers and right now we are looking at it so it is up. So you're going to come up here to layer, new fill layer, solid color and you can say group with previous layer. That's very important. That's what's going to make it only apply to the frame and not the entire project. And then you just choose a color. So you can just push this up and down or you can put in the hexadecimal color. As you can see it's changing so whatever color you want to choose. I'm going to go back up here to red and then you just click OK. And that's basically what you need to do for each of the frames. If you want the frames to be that color you can, let me double click this, you can copy this Control C and then you can do it to the next frame quickly. So I have this one highlighted layer, new fill, solid group with previous and then I just paste it in there control V and OK and now the next one is changed and you just keep going like that until they're all changed. Her second question was how do I change stroke and outer glow on the font and so basically you just come up here to the little FX double click it and where you see red here that is going to correlate with the red on the football so if I double click that I can change that color that is the outer glow the stroke is right here and you can also change that color and then you can also ch change the size of these. I'm over exaggerating it so that you can see how I've changed it. Then you click OK and then her last question was how do I change the font? So basically you come here and double click, come up here and just change it to whatever font you want, That what font you have. I'll just quickly change it and then if it's too big then you can come up here and change the size and then you can just keep adjusting that until it's the way you want it. I do want to show you in Photoshop how to change the frame color. So here's, here's a similar frame. Here's my layers palette it's a lot easier in Photoshop because you just double click the FX, you click on color overlay and then you just click in here and change it to any color you want. I'm going to turn this little for web only off and so you can just change it to any color you want and you can paste the code in here as well and so it's a little bit easier to change it in Photoshop. Hey, that was easy. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions about this tutorial or any of our products, you can always reach us at easydigitals.com. Have a creative day.